Football fans around the world look up to legends like Ronaldo, Messi, and this chick from Norway. But have you ever wondered who these guys idolize? This is La Nutmeg Field Fairy, the fourth, an 11-year-old prodigy with a condition that every time his boot touches the ball, it's a piss-missile top-shelf banger. It's rumored that Ronaldo has a poster of La Nutmeg in his room. Messi recently threw a fit that La Nutmeg was stealing his spotlight and ruining his legacy, so he had Field Ferry traded back to England where Manchester United signed Lay Nutmeg to a $1 billion per match contract. But in the fine print, they said if Field Ferry gets a red card, he gets nothing. La Nutmeg has scored 42 goals in his first three games back in the Premier League, but has gotten kicked out of every match due to his extremely dangerous anger issues. He attacks anyone who calls the sport football instead of soccer. La Nutmeg's bank account is currently in the negative, despite being the greatest soccer player of all time. Anyway, a lot of people consider this little midget guy named Lionel from Argentina the goat of soccer. The most goals this so-called legend has scored in a season is 50 in his 2011-2012 season with FC Barcelona. Messi's 50 goals in 37 matches may seem impressive to everyone, but La Nutmeg Field Fairy the fourth. This 11-year-old menace has taken the Premier League by storm, scoring one effortless piss-missile top bin banger after another. He probably would have broken all of Messi's records already if he didn't have severe anger issues that lands him a red card every game. Manchester United and La Nutmeg just made a deal that if La Nutmeg breaks Messi's single-season scoring record of 50 in less than three games, he will become the owner of the team. In his three games, La Nutmeg has selected to face off against Ronaldo's poverty Saudi Arabian squad, the current EAFC Shemale cover athletes team, and then finish up against the man himself in Miami. Will La Nutmeg break Messi's scoring record in three games? There's only one way to find out. Comment your prediction right now. If you think La Nutmeg will surpass the Messi, Drop how many games it will take now. You guys will not believe what's about to happen. Let's jump in. All right, disregard the ordering because we are taking Messi in game one. The stage is set and the crowd is sold out to witness the greatest soccer player of all time against Messi. And here we are at one of the great venues for football anywhere in the world. Old Trafford in Manchester. I'm your Matt. Oh, in with a chance. Well punched away by the keeper. Oh, terrific goal. How about that? La Nutmeg scores the easiest goal I've ever witnessed to start the game. Inter Miami is a bunch of burger flippers, forklift drivers, and Premier League wannabes. But you won't believe what happens next. La Nutmeg sees his opportunity and Brexit's Messi, shattering his MCL and kneecaps into pieces. That's the end of his soccer career. The referee wastes no time at all and gives Field Fairy a red card, meaning that we just scored a goal and got kicked out of the game in a matter of seconds. One goal in the first game out of three isn't a good start, but at least he ended Messi's career. All right, let's head over to Camel Land for game two. Well, everyone is happy here at Old Trafford for the time being. I say that because the sun is shining brightly. I'm Derek Ray, ready hit. Well, it could be on for him here. In it goes, an early goal. No wonder they're celebrating. Once again, the 11-year-old wastes no time at all scoring an easy banger against Ronaldo and his poverty Saudi Arabian team. But once again, Lay Nutmeg forgot to take his anger management pills and just attacks his opponent's legs any chance he gets. Somehow, the referee just gave him a warning for that. No card issued, even though that player needs to be carted off and taken to the nearest hospital. The very next play, Field Fairy misses the slide tackle, but pops up and smacks a piss, missile volley banger goal. On the next possession, a camel player takes the ball from La Nutmeg, so he hawks him down and takes him out. That's a yellow for Field Fairy, and he is not happy about it. It's not safe to be on field right now. La Nutmeg takes his anger into the next play and takes out two camels, one being Ronaldo. And you guessed it, that's a red card. He just ended two careers with one Brexit. That's definitely never been done before. Two games down and we have made zero progress toward our goal of 50. But... On the bright side, La Nutmeg ended Ronaldo and Messi's football careers, meaning that he's the undisputed GOAT now. Time for the third and final match. So much riding on this game. Manchester is alive with the prospect of a city-wide clash. These fans cannot wait any longer. Nothing will be held back here today. Kickoff is almost upon us.
Don't go anywhere. All the action coming up next. All roads lead to Manchester today, and we're at the Etihad for a special derby. It is City versus United. Derek Ray here on the... Might be a chance here. Safe pair of hands, did his job. Well, goalkeeper mistake, will there be a price to pay? Oh, surely! And a goal! United forge ahead in the derby! And that has silenced the majority in here! Only 46 goals to go after this one to tie Lionel. Just so everyone remembers what's at stake here, if Lay Nutmeg scores 47 goals, he becomes the owner of Manchester United. Plus, Field Fairy bet Erling Holland before the game that whoever scores the most goals gets to stay on the cover of EAFC. Comment which cover is cooler. Side note, while La Nutmeg puts on a masterclass in the background, hit that subscribe button right now if you want to see Lay Nutmeg on the cover of the next EAFC. It's just a button and it goes a long way. You can help me become one subscriber closer to making this cover become reality. Let's go, baby. Now sit back, relax, and kick your feet up because you are about to witness the craziest single-game performance in the history of sports. I don't care if you're not a soccer fan or if you're one of those diehards that call this game football. La Nutmeg brings everyone together with his angelic footwork and absolute mistletop shelf snipes. I love how this announcer gets so hype every goal no matter what. But peep this, Lay Nutmeg's teammate scores a goal. Is he an idiot? Pass the ball, Bozo. Lay Nutmeg channels his inner manager and sends him to the bench and plans to trade him to Camelville with Ronaldo after the match. This game is all about field fairy, not some other no-name random. And it's United's turn now. And he might be through here. And in! Oh, yes! Exactly what they were hoping to produce. Can he get onto this? And the chance is on. It's gone in! Watch here as the goalkeeper literally just passes the ball to Field Ferry, who easily sends a volley missile back into the net. What an idiot. Manchester City's goalkeeper should be working as a full-time coal miner after today's performance. And Field Ferry is just getting warmed up. Messi is shaking in his boots in his hospital bed. Doesn't want his precious record to get broken. Keep the ball by Manchester City. Goodness gracious me! Real chance. And a goal this time. Applying the finishing touch. Just what the doctor ordered. Peep that header goal, man. So inspirational. What a lovely strike. The net is Just toying with the, the defense. All right, this might be the best goal you'll ever see in your lifetime. Any soccer or football players watching should get out a pen and paper and write this down. Do whatever Lane Nutmeg does here at least once a game because it's unstoppable. you all you need to and in with a real chance oh what a top-notch pass could be in here a goal here giving his team precise He's through oh yeah oh such an elegant finish and a long way out here take oh. advantage must be an effort. happy to take on the shot just unable to get his cross beat. Oh, chance taken! Can he put it away? There it is! A fantastic goal! And no wonder There's he's no, They need to get tighter. Can't really allow runs like that. Oh, yes! It's gone in! And now a chance for them to revel in the moment! Textbook closing down. And this time it's in! Fabulous goal! And just look at the celebrations! Oh my 
All right, that's 32 goals at halftime, 35 total if you're counting the first two games. He is on pace but just needs to stay out of foul trouble. Field Ferry got a yellow card in the first half when he absolutely lit up that defenseman. So La Nutmeg is popping anger management pills in the locker room now. Haaland is mad that he's not going to be on the cover anymore, so he ordered his teammates to hurt La Nutmeg as you see this taxi driver try to take him out. But Field Ferry just continues to ball out with one banger after another. Peep this one. That barely crosses the plane. What a goal. And having a goal! on the ball. Oh, he's gone for goal. Oh, goodness gracious me. It's a special, special goal from him with a chance. Oh, my goodness. He did have the... Oh, big opportunity. What a lovely strike. That's a good-looking shot. As payback, Field Ferry made a train conductor on his team take out Erling's legs. Lay Nutmeg would have done it himself if he didn't already have a yellow. The no-name bum gets a red card for sending Hayland to the emergency room. Despite having one less player on the field, Lanutmeg immediately scores an insane diving header banger to inch his way closer to the history books. Might as well not even have a goalie in there, man. This guy needs to hang up his cleats. And going for goal. Oh my goodness. What's an and there is the goal. Sloppy in possession from City. Oh, he's through here. Oh my this God. snipe right here ties Messi's wow, single season this. scoring record. Man City is tired of Field Ferry diddling their defense, so they just take him out in the box. That's a and big a mistake, penalty. buddy. Lay Nutmeg will not ball. forget that. And it's going from he has a chance here to surpass the midget. Anyway, pause the video right here and guess where Lay Nutmeg is going to shoot this PK in the comment section. Anyone get it? Here's it in real time because it's satisfying to watch. And, there it is. and just like that, Lay Nutmeg surpasses and Messi with ease but doesn't stop there. La Nutmeg buries another shot to take the record. He heads over to the camera to taunt Messi, who's watching from his hospital bed. There's a new sheriff in town, baby. Field Ferry keeps his foot on the pedal and continues his scoring onslaught, even though he already broke the record just to rub it in some more. Comment name ideas for what we will change Manchester United to. To enter a La Nutmeg Field Ferry, the fourth jersey giveaway. Because you are a real one if you made it this far. Before today's match, the record for the most goals in a match by an entire team is 27, and Lay Nutmeg just dropped 62 in one game. But, typical Field Ferry fashion, he absolutely takes out some guy's meniscus and gets his second yellow card of the game, but who cares? We did it. La Nutmeg smothered Messi's unimpressive record by 15 goals in three games while getting ejected from every single one, and keep in mind, He's only 11. Once this video gets 5,000 likes, I'll drop an update on Manchester United's name and relocation. Spam the likes and hit that subscribe button to help the Lay family make history. Let's get Lay Nutmeg on the cover.